Rob, a great result for us on Friday night and you must have been, on a personal level, really pleased with the man and match performance. Yeah, it was great to get the win. Obviously, we haven't won there in, you know, I think it's 10 or 11 years and um, it's a tough place to go to. Franklin's Gardens, a you know, big, passionate crowd and it was vital we got a really good start and then uh, managed to close out the game. You could feel it in the week building up that those are the kind of games that everyone looks forward to. Northampton have been a top four, top six side for a long time, so it was a big one. Yeah, we spoke in the week about, obviously, we'd had a good couple of weeks in Europe and, you know, confidence was higher, but we had to take that into into our league form and, uh, you know, boys really stepped up and picked up that intensity for the, for the win. Going forward, I think it's great to see some guys slot into that side with guys away international duty and away injured. That's the strength of this squad. Definitely, you know, obviously a couple of the guys away with international stuff and um, you know, credit to them, they've been fantastic for us all season and then obviously some of the boys who slotted in really uh, put the hand up and did a good job for us. For you personally, you've obviously had that injury early on in the season and then had to wait quite patiently. You must be enjoying having a good run of games. Yeah, it's frustrating at the start of the season, obviously a bit of a hamstring injury. It took a little bit longer than, uh, than first expected and then, uh, yeah, it's obviously great to get a run of games in the team. It's, um, you know, it's been a massive squad effort all season with boys with injuries and obviously now away with international duty and hopefully we can continue that into the into the spring. A lot of the talk building up to that Saints game was about consistency. We've obviously had a great run in Europe, but bringing that back into the Premiership was key. And I guess this weekend against Newcastle is another test and making sure we keep those levels high. Exactly. Yeah, I think, you know, week in, week out, you know, the Premiership's pretty, um, you know, it's a real tough, tough league. And I think now we're on a spin of about 10 or 11 consecutive games. and. For us, it's about really concentrating each week and you know looking to see what threats Newcastle have got. You know they're a big physical pack; they keep hold of the ball very well, and and obviously they've got dangerous runners in the back. So for us, we really need to be on top of our game to uh, to get the win. They had a great result at the weekend, and I guess that just throws it into even sharper focus how much of a threat they'll be this weekend. Exactly, that you know the confidence will be uh, will be sky high after that win against Quinns. Um, you know Quinns are top three, top four side, and. For them to turn them over is huge for them, and you know, they're going to be full of confidence and look to look to come down and obviously repeat that. But you know, we're we're pretty confident ourselves. We've you know we came off the back of a good couple of weeks in Europe, like I said, and and obviously Northampton the week before. But you know, we really need to to concentrate on on our own job to uh, to get the result. And for us, returning to the Rico Arena, that support will obviously be huge. Definitely, I think you know, for the, certainly the length of the game, the the support was fantastic and. Um, you know, really sort of the atmosphere was, was electric really and um, hopefully you know, it's something we want to replicate each week.